with you. So, all right. Um, so basically, I was asking you kind of like, um, what is the the model uh, right. glider that you had? You said yeah. it was made in the Czech Republic. Yeah, yeah. This is a Shadow. It's a okay. uh, 3.7 meter uh, competition level okay. glider. It's uh, got six servos. There's four servos in the wing. Okay. There are two servos running the uh, elevator and rudder. Okay. Uh, the speed controller, it's a it's a electric launch glider okay, electric as opposed launch, yeah. to a winch launch glider. Okay. And it's um, uh, it's basically set up for uh, the competition uh, is a 30 second motor launch okay. followed by a 10 minute task. Okay. Okay. And then, um, and then there's landing points uh, for a spot landing. Okay. So that's what uh, basically you've got here, and uh, you know there it's a full cambered. Uh, you can camber the wing. Okay. Uh, trailing edge, so that that way, uh, you know, you can adjust how much lift you want. So I can, Mike I can, I can, I, I, can, I can drop, I can drop the. I can drop the the trailing edge okay and and I also have full flaps and full flaps. if you notice the flaps the flaps oh, yeah, will go, go the flaps will go almost 90 wow. degrees yeah they are really like, okay and basically it's a speed brake yeah so you're not used you don't have an, a speed brake you have basically flaps flaps is which you can for use descent control descent My, control okay okay now there we go. There. yeah and so the um, yeah that, that that's what you use for your descent okay, control okay. Is, is flaps and what is your so the wing? What is the width of the wing? Well, the it's like the, the the span okay. is three point seven meters. Three point seven meters. Yeah, okay. and it's basically uh, and a ten inch cord. Okay. 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 So it's a you know a high meters. performance, high, okay. efficiency, high efficiency, you know, yeah. a high aspect ratio yeah. wing. Yeah. Uh, and uh, this this plane is a little heavier than okay. some of my other competition mm -hmm. sailplanes mm -hmm. uh, but it's basically sort of my windy day airplane okay but um, and, and and but you know you can use it for whatever okay what so what uh, what is the power on the ESC on that yeah well it's basically like a... I've got a uh, I think I have a, a, a castle creations um 50 amp speed controller okay. on this okay and uh, this is a geared motor okay so it's a geared uh, uh i think it's a six to one okay. high uh rpm uh motor okay okay and uh then we got a 16 by eight inch prop on the front okay. it's folding so okay. as soon as the motor goes off the brake goes on and the uh, propeller stops turning. Okay. Okay. But, um, now, have you used this in competition at all? Or? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. I've, I've, I've used this in competition. in competition when, when it's when it gets really windy. Okay. Uh, you need a heavier airplane. A heavy airplane. To basically sort of cut through the. Do you have an idea of the weight on it at all? Or? Yeah, I do. Yeah. This 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 plane weighs uh, 68 ounces. Okay. Okay. Uh, and then the battery weighs about an extra three ounces. Okay. What is so. the battery that you use on this? It's a three cell. A three cell. It, it, it's just like a three cell. It's just a three cell. Like 1800 uh, or 1200. Uh, 1300 is my favorite yeah. uh, real big, but... battery. Yeah, because I only need it for 30 seconds. You only need it to get up there. Right. I yeah. only I only uh, run it up and and, and the there is a uh, barometer in here. Okay. That basically turns off the speed controller. Really. At and it's a choosable height. So okay. I, so I, but typically we run either 150 meters or 200 meters up. Okay. And it, it, it'll, so if you get to 200 meters okay. before the 30 seconds okay. is over, uh, it'll turn the motor off automatically. Okay. Wow. So that way, basically everybody launches to the same altitude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it's, so oh, it, it, even, it, evens, it evens out the competition. And you pretty much just take it up there, the motor shuts off. And then we hunt the thermal, for thermals. And then we hunt for thermals. Thermal, and you just bring it back down. And yeah, yeah. So, okay. but, but typically, this airplane, uh, if you don't find thermals, will come out of the sky in five minutes. Five, okay, six, so it's five, five drop. six minutes. It needs a thermal. So you cannot, there. you cannot go for the full you ten unless, unless you find something. Okay. Find some decent lift. So up how there. how long have you usually have you had it up there? Like on a typical day, you get thermals. Well, you stay up there for a real long well, time. Yeah, I've, I've I've flown for two hours. Okay. On the, wow. Two Not hours. on this airplane, okay. but on another on airplane. On another one. Yeah, you on get another the high performance and you just keep high, going. high performance sailplane. Okay. I'll launch and two hours later, I can I, I came down. But, okay. Uh, I mean okay. that's. That's kind of it's kind of boring after a while, yeah, but yeah, yeah. so you know I just I I, I, I do fly 
uh, you know, fly for typically, I, I typically go for that 10 minute task. Okay, okay. And so that way I'm sort of dialed into, you know, okay. the, the task at, uh, for um, competitions. So your flight, your servos and your motor, they're all using the same the same pack. Correct. Right? Correct. Okay. Yeah, it's it's okay. it's a BEC. BEC. There's okay. a BEC yeah, on the BEC on the uh, on the speed controller. Okay. Yeah. Now I'd be interested. If maybe we could look at the uh, the radio. So yeah, I the Tyrannus. Yeah, I see you're yeah. using the Tyrannus. This is the Tyrannus, okay. and it's it's of course it can do anything you want it to do. It, yeah. it, it talks to you. It times you. It tells me we've got a variometer, got in, the variometer in the uh, in the fuselage, so yeah. it tells me my altitude, or it, it gives me a tone. So okay. I can I can set it for either you know nothing or tone okay. or actually it'll broadcast the altitude and it'll the tell altitude. me 463 feet okay. you know every 10 seconds or every five seconds depending upon how I program my tra my uh, transmitter. Okay. Now if you're using the Tyrannus um, for that functionality, how much are you really talking at, co at cost? When it comes to your receiver, I'm sure you need a special module, variometer yeah. module, and all that. Yeah. Like, how much but does the, it cost? The, the, the Tyrannus uh, receivers are only thirty bucks. Yeah, they're cheap, right? Okay. They're like, they're and like, and you have my one in there. Or you have two. Uh, no, I have one. Just, okay. Just okay. one in just there with the two antennas uh, okay. sticking out. Um, this is a. There is yeah, some carbon. The there is some right carbon there. in this fuselage. Okay. So I've got the antennas, whiskers. Oh, uh, you, you have know, to watch out for that. At the side. Okay. But um. Uh, the uh, variometer, the high precision variometer is 25 bucks. So it's really very so it, cost efficient. It's, 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 not, it's not real expensive. Yeah. The, 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 plane, the plane is expensive. The plane is the expense. Can yeah. I, what, like on an order yeah, of the the, expense? The, this shadow is $1,300. Okay, empty. yeah, because you were telling me it's, it's a yeah. high performance. It's a high performance, European, uh, Eastern European manufactured yeah. okay. um, plane. It's imported and and so it uh, it comes with a fairly decent. Price it came tag. as an ARF, and you and you. It came as really? an ARF when we just okay. we just put the, drop the servos in it and, and the rest and, of the gear and everything and you're else. Pretty much but good typically to go. the, um, for example, in this airplane and most airplanes actually, the push rods for the rudder and elevator, are all you know they come in. Yeah. With yeah. the uh, with the airplane, okay. already pre-installed. Okay. 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 Um, so that's the expense is really in the airplane. It is. Yeah. 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 But you've been pretty happy with the Tyrannus and, and everything the else. It's is, pretty nice radio, I, I've right? given up on everything else. Yeah. I mean, only because of the cost. <laughs> the cost, yeah. I mean, I mean, yeah. it delivers everything. I mean, I could, I, mm -hmm. if I wanted to put a second receiver in here, it's got me. It gives me 32 channels. Yeah. I okay. mean, I, and I don't even use 16. Really I mean, I've, I've got 16 yeah. if I want it. Yeah. Uh, but you know, I, I'm only using seven, which yeah. is. Well, that's why a lot of people seem to like it. You know, yeah. just like you're saying. It's, it's very efficient uh, cost wise yeah, you know like I have helicopter where the fly bars we use for each helicopter you're spending like two to three hundred dollars you know put it in there so um, the expense can add up right definitely the more you have right. all right great um, so what we'll you... do is we'll launch okay okay we'll launch, launch. launch and uh, I'll just I'll just make it a real quick yeah uh, flight because yeah, you already did a flight before yeah, I yeah, saw yeah, you yeah. Well, there. yeah, and what I want, uh, we'll, yeah, what we'll do is we'll launch, and then I'll bring it in for a high-speed pass. Okay, that's and then, perfect. And then that we'll bring it in for a landing. Perfect. Yeah, that's that's more than fine. Yeah. That's perfect. All right. Okay. Ready. Okay, folks. Let me just wiggle. Make sure we got everything we need here. All right, and launch. <laughs> up there. Yeah. So what do you think your height is now? Well here. 451 feet. Wow you got up there fast. Yeah. And there's the engine off. We reached our altitude. Okay. And we'll switch it over to thermal mode. I'm gonna 545 feet. And every, I've got it broadcasting its altitude every 10 seconds. Okay. 506 feet. Yeah, right now I'm not in a thermal. 
I can tell you right now, the thermal is behind us and over to the left. Okay, now how do you know when you have a thermal? 95. That's something always well, kind of Well, I mean, I can listen to the you can altimeter. Hear that you're just, that you're I can getting... Yeah, I can hear that I'm getting okay. higher and higher or lower and lower. Okay. But I can... 69. But after a while, you get to know your air. Okay. And basically, what we're going to do is we're going to look for... Uh, see, see, we're in sinking air. We, okay. we went through a lot of sinking air there. And we can feel that the air is blowing in this direction okay and generally speaking the air uh, blows towards a thermal so at okay. some point that's at, what i've heard yeah at, at, at some point i can go out here and oh i can right now i'm not losing any altitude uh -huh. so what we'll do is i'll find something right about there Okay, we went. Nice thing about gliders is they fly slow enough that you can. Uh, All right, wow. There go. It's a big glider though, because you're high up there, and it still yeah, kind of yeah, looks I'm big still, right I'm now. Still, I'm still 300 feet up. Okay. But, but I did not find. Didn't find a good thermal. Any thermal Yeah, because you're slow. You lost quick. about 100 feet there. Yeah. 264 feet. 231 feet. Yeah, and I'm still losing. I'm still losing. And that's sinking here right over there. And what we'll do is we'll just we'll just bring it in for a okay. uh, high speed pass. Here. Yeah. Just not real high speed, but you know. Just bring it by. Yeah. Wow. Gliders always make like an interesting no sound yeah, they're when they go by. Yeah. No propeller noise. No propeller noise. That's all wing. Yeah. And we'll bring it around here and land it in front of us. And there's always a, uh, a spot landing task mm -hmm. that you have and the flaps help in that. Yes. Nice. There we go. <laughs> Pretty sweet, thank you very much. That's your, that's your basic competition glider routine. Routine. Yep. Oh, thank you very much. You bet.